So, what are you in here for? For being black. <laughs> I'm fat, black, can't dance, and I have two gay fathers. There's no sense getting all riled up every time a bunch of idiots give you a hard time. Kind of relatable, the actually. Tends to unfold as it should. Interesting. Plus, I have a really large penis. That keeps me happy. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, we're doing something really different today. We're going to be skipping our whole shenanigans and funny, silly little intros that we usually do. We decided to tell the Patreon, hey guys, we're going to be doing another stoner comedy movie. So here's a poll with four great ones. And you're going to pick what we watch because, of course, Pineapple Express did very well. A lot of positive comments. You guys really enjoyed the shit out of that one. Yeah. We're like, you know what? We will do another. So we're doing Harold and Kumar. Go to White Castle. I'm actually really excited to watch this. Super excited to watch this film. Speaking of, um, Pineapple Express, actually. Uh, some of you guys didn't get a joke that was said at the ending of that reaction where I said, all people who smoke weed are losers. Again, it was a joke. I feel like there has been 350 plus videos on the channel at this very moment. You could watch every single one of them and I guarantee you, I have called somebody a loser, some group of people a loser. It's not anything different. And for some reason, this one time, I call people who smoke weed losers. That's the line you guys draw. I called the bald losers. I've called short people losers. All kinds of people. Have you seen what I've said about the people who are not subscribed to the channel at this very moment? I called them losers. I've said they smell like shit. I said I threatened to beat them up. I said it would be fine if their family, their entire bloodline got eliminated. Yep. Where's the outcry? Nothing. You don't even care about them. You're selfish. You care about yourselves. Like, True. if anything, you would, should be defending those who are not subscribed to the channel. There's more of them than there are you who smoke weed out there. I have the stats. I'll pull them up. A lot of you guys aren't subscribed, goddammit, and you should be. It's as simple as that. At the end of the day, it is truthfully a joke. We thought it would be so ironic. It would be hilarious. To go out of our way to watch a stoner comedy. And then just Enjoy shit. the shit out of the film. We loved it. We and loved we thought it. it would be funny if we just shit on you. Yeah. yeah. And the thing is, it's just like, we thought you guys would get the joke. You know, when you hear stoners, they're usually people who are considered the chillest of the chill. You guys proved me wrong. No. I don't know what the hell you're smoking over there, all right? No. You need to smoke a hell of a lot more and chill out. Check with your dealer. You may have oregano in that bag. Honestly, it's not powerful enough. You guys either triple, double, I would say even hell, quadruple degree. Find the real Pineapple Express, man, and lit it. Light one for us, all right, guys? Because we sure as hell won't. Light one for us, we won't. You know what? Light two for us, all right? There's two of us. Harold and Kumar, baby, give it to them. Show them White Castle, baby. Why don't you just get somebody else to do your work for you? Oh, Harold. Nice. You need to update those models for me. Something just came up. I have this meeting with these new clients tonight, and I'm never gonna have time to get to those. So, oh god, it's your responsibility now. Oh god, book. I hate when they do. Uh, oh, sure. not the fist bump! I hate when they just grab your shoulder and they just like fist bump it. Okay, no problem. No, hey. no. no. Tell me eat shit. Have a great weekend, okay, buddy? You hit him with this? Oh my god! I hate when people do that. They push their work off on other people. Yeah. God. Numbers. He probably just made his weekend. <laughs> oh, made his weekend? You ruined it. His license plate is ladies, man. No way. Yeah. Oh, God. You are one of the finest applicants I have ever interviewed. Oh, thank you. And it comes as no surprise, your father is highly respected in this field. And oh, you cool. you probably heard from your old man. He and I had some pretty wild times back in med school. Really? Oh okay. yeah, we started our own basketball team. Hemoglobin trotters? What? That's actually a good joke. Trotters I hate that shit so much, it's so good. Colored, uh, Negro basketball huh? squad. Huh? Wait, like, what? African American. <laughs> oh, <wait, wait. laughs> Why did you just start with that? I'm gonna be honest with you, the only reason I'm applying is so my dad will keep paying for my apartment. I really don't have a desire to go to med school. But you have oh. MCAT scores. Yeah, just because you're hung like a moose doesn't mean you got to do porn. <laughs> and please bring in some fresh diarrhea. Dry <laughs> some fresh what? Some fresh diarrhea. Oh, God. But he's got a point, man. Just because you're good at this thing doesn't mean that's the thing you want to do. Exactly. Okay, there's... This no. is America, dude. Learn how to drive. Better run tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Who does that? Like, what, what's with the tongue? Okay, be yourself. Don't be nervous. Good advice. Okay, good luck. What's the tactic here, buddy? What's the strat? Okay, good start. Okay. Oh, alone. So what are you up to tonight? 
Actually, I'm just gonna be sitting on my ass, probably eat a whole pint of Hagen dazs while I watch Blind Date. Well, okay, that sounds, not bad. That, that sounds awful. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> Listen, if you want some company, maybe you can come over and sit on your ass at my place. Woo! That sounds nice. He's got game! No! Oh. It was all a lie! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh! Oh! <clears throat> this is so uncomfortable. Oh shit! Oh, oh my god! Ooh, that that felt awkward. Oh, wait. Oh, you say something! You piece of shit! You had it! Something. That was easy. She didn't think you were ugly or hideous. She looked back. Fifty said, Curtis, a fellow Curtis. Yeah, he I haven't heard this song in a long time. No, they revamped that lyric, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Beetlejuice! Beetlejuice! He had a Beetlejuice poster picture? Why do you have a Beetlejuice picture? Hey! Whoa! 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 whoa. Hey, yo! I'm trimming my pubes. Why aren't you doing this in your room, man? The mirror's in here. Oh, Check fair it point. It's like a bonsai tree. <laughs> what? Are those my scissors? <gasps> Dude, I trimmed my nose hair with those. Dude, I've been cutting my ass hair with them for the past six months. Get out of my room. Just take the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what's this shit say? I love. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh man, that's funny. That's great. Just take one hit. Don't you want to be cool? <laughs> <laughs> Why is he laughing like that? I'm so high! <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> no! <laughs> what, was what was that? No! no. You sound like a ghost! <laughs> Come to White Castle and try our slider special. Six burgers, fries, and a soft drink mm -hmm. for only $2.99. Wait, six burgers? Don't you like food that's tasty and delicious? Yeah! Then wait yeah. on the Head over to White Castle. Okay. You sure you know how to get there? I haven't been to White Castle in ages. Dude, I'm telling you, there's one right by that multiplex in New Brunswick. Nice. Hey, yo. In New Brunswick? Hey, yo, we in Canada? Katie Holmes is a nice, respectable, wholesome girl. And I'm gonna see her boobs. <laughs> the things I would eat out of her ass. You have... <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Whoa! A vulgar statement. So is I want to bang Britney Spears on the bathroom floor. But it's true. Oh, you got okay. one. Well, hey, listen, if... <laughs> <laughs> I think Kumar's a fagel. Oh, they're totally gay for each other. Mm. What? Well, you want to suck on this? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> hey, there's your girlfriend. If she Whoa! Gonna this time, you're gonna be a fucking vagina McGinesty in the back. Go. Oh, he's running. What the hell? Dude, come on. To come to we'll White Castle with us. Wait. Oh, bro, no! You didn't hold it. You didn't. You're worthless, bro. I'm not worthwhile, bro. You're literally sabotaging yourself. There's no <sighs> way. Oh look, it's the brothers McFay. Let me guess, the one with the purse is the catcher. <laughs> Damn, isn't that a satchel? Fucking Mountain Dew. <laughs> extreme. Yeah, extreme asshole. Mountain Dew. Why do I have to be the catcher, dude? Forget about those pricks. Let's just get some food. True, man. Food is the objective. We gotta focus. Nice. What's going on? It didn't oh. register. What? Uh, give me 35 more cents. I hate tolls, man. I know. Yeah, we need some tunage for this. Uh, uh, right. Presets, right. presets, use the presets. Oh, come on, dude. Your whole life is preset. Try something new. <laughs> damn, that was actually kind of harsh, man. God damn. What the hell's going on, come on? It's a burger shot. does not look like a light castle to me. Uh-uh. Yeah, we gotta check this out. What is this shit? What's a burger shack? Burger shack, they bought this location about four years ago. Please tell me there's another White Castle yeah. in town. No. Are you sure? Do I look like the kind of brother that would be unsure about something like that? <laughs> <laughs> Should we just eat here? Hey. Psst. Oh. There's a White Castle that's open 24 hours up in Cherry Hill. Uh -huh. It's about 45 minutes from here. I can oh. make the trip if you're willing to. Kamara, I got a shitload of work to finish. 
You got that med school interview. Oh, on, man. Forget about Pussy. the med school interview. <laughs> <laughs> just thinking about those tender little White Castle burgers. With those little itty bitty grilled onions that just explode. Oh, grilled onions. This makes me want to burn this motherfucker down. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Come on, Boogie, let's burn this motherfucker down. Yeah! Burn the burger shack! Burn it down! Kill it! So, uh, <laughs> you guys maybe should just suck it up and go to White Castle. Winners go to White Castle. You know, get your True. Losers go to Burger Shack. Let's do it. All right. We never settle when it comes to a burger. Hell no, man. Never. We get the burger we're craving. We're going to sweet talk Cindy Kim into finding us some weed. No. Why not? You talk to her on the phone all the time. She calls me. And then she rambles on about her East Asian Students Club or whatever. Oh. Then I have to actually pretend that I give a shit or else she calls me a Twinkie. No. A what? Why? <laughs> Twinkie, yellow on the outside, white on the inside. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. I am not seeing Cindy Kim. Harold, I'm so glad you showed up. Yeah. He's not. Me too. <laughs> Did you like the hibiscus petals I glued to the envelope I sent you? Yeah, they were they were nice. Mm. Hey, dude, you know where I can get Did she just say hibiscus? Yeah, I think so. Is that a hibiscus? Or is that a, is that a pun? I, 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 was, that a, was, that, was that a pun? I hope not. Oh my god. Whoa, man. Ow. Don't touch, man. That's not cool. You can't... Ow. <laughs> this is my baby. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> is it true you're an analyst for Brewster Keegan? Yes, I'm a junior analyst. Awesome. <laughs> I told you, he's good. Huh? What? <laughs> oh, God! What's it like being an investment banker? And B, would you write me a recommendation? It's shit and no. 80 bucks. 80 bucks? 80? 80 bucks. Yo, this is worth 40 tops. There's oh, lots man. of people around here. See this guy? Hey, loser. I smoke. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! There it is! There it is! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. To be honest with you, it's actually pretty... Don't destroy his dreams. Their dreams? Awesome. <laughs> Kenny's mom dropped off a big pot of kimchi jjigae. It's really good. <laughs> it's delicious. I bet. Cool. Mama's cooking's always the best. Hey, you guys about to smoke. Do you want to come back to my place? Please. Please. Like, they want to go listen to a bunch of fish records while you read your lame-ass poetry. <laughs> yeah! Oh, no. Smoke a little weed and have some fun. All right. My poetry's not lame, it's really good. Yeah, I'm sure it's, it's great. Oh, no! We'll see you ladies later. Yes! Bro, just stop. No, We're bro. getting laid, bro. Not you, bro. Not you. You've never been laid. <laughs> come on. Oh, dude, Too much. You gotta come quick. There's these two filthy pussies just aching to get boned by us. What? Why would you say it like that? There's two very lovely young pussies who would like. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to the party. No, 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 no. fuck that. Here. This is Harold's understudy, okay? You can do whatever you want with him. Oldie, let's... <laughs> Wait, what? Sorry. Can't believe you're gonna ditch me for the Joy Luck Club, dude. You know what their parties are like. Come on, man. What do you want me to say? I was under pressure. I'm just just say no. That's all it takes. Here. True, actually. And hey, what's going on up there? Barracuda to Sparrow, Barracuda to Sparrow. We got two high flyers on level... Barracuda to Sparrow? Cool names. Let's hope he finds us in here. Chill the fuck out. He's not gonna look for us in the girls' bathroom. Oh, true, actually. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Your breasts look beautiful. Okay. Cute little ping pong breasts, you know, that kind of goes. Ping pong? Ping pong? Just run? 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 What are you doing? Do you want to play battleships? Oh my god. What? We haven't played that since back at camp. What do they do at camp? Battleships? <laughs> Skag, you sank my destroyer. What? How do you know? <gasps> no! no! Was that like 80 bucks? That was 80 bucks. My man just wasted 80 bucks. Run! Damn! You sank my battle shit. Shit. Yeah, that's a lot of paper, my god. Daddy needs to urinate. All right, Hurry big up. boy makes a pee pee. Let's go. I'm serious. Don't take all night. Dude, don't leave your door uh, open. I'm, I, I don't know about like if that's a good idea or not to leave it open. That's bizarre. 
Oh, a little friend. Oh. That's a scary little friend. That's ugly as shit. <laughs> you just like to be one with nature. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's that look on his face? He looks terrified. Why are you peeing on it? Well, no one was here when I chose this bush. Oh. So you get to pee on it? No one else does? <laughs> you fucking tree hugger? Is this your special bush? <laughs> Never mind. Forget it. I really don't feel like getting stabbed tonight. What? Why, is it, why, why? why are you looking? Are you king of the forest? <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. How do you explain it? Yeah, they, yeah, you just move on. Yeah, there's nothing to say. After all the shit that we've been through tonight, I don't know how much more I can take. Yeah! Oh! 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 <laughs> oh god. Oh shit. Uh oh. He's no oh, they're not happy. Bitch! What the fuck are you doing? We're sorry! Huh? We're sorry! We're very sorry! Oh! Wait, what? Why are they here? Right. What, what the hell are you guys doing here, Harold? We just got the munchies, so we decided we go to hot dog heaven. How about you? Hot, hot dog, dog heaven? heaven. How are Katie Holmes's tits? You know the Holocaust? Yeah. Picture the exact opposite of that. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, shit. <laughs> oh, what a comparison. Yeah, I don't have babies. <clears throat> Great. Let's get nice. out of here. Hey, aren't those... Aren't those the guys that got the oh. shit kicked? Oh, no. It's the lamer versions. Ma? <gasps> you have one more interview tomorrow morning. And if I hear from Dr. Veen that you are anything short of spectacular, I'll completely cut you off. Dad, come on. Daddy oh. is not coming on anything. Wow, man. So I guess you're going to med school after all, eh? <laughs> Fuck that, dude. Like, I care what my dad thinks. <laughs> his face when he finds out I didn't go to my interview tomorrow. He wants to cut me off? Fine. I don't need his money. I don't, I don't understand. Are you sure? You just hug him and do it. Access card. Two words for you, bro. Medical marijuana. Oh! Oh. Whoa! We're not gonna get caught, okay? We're gonna go get baked and then go eat just like we planned. Now just calm down. We gotta find the pharmacy. Dr. Patel! Thank God I found you. We have an emergency. Shut up. <laughs> it's a godforsaken bloodbath. The patient was brought in by EMS five minutes ago. Has he oh, shit! We need to sedate the patient or he could go into cardiac arrest. All right, I'll get the anesthesiologist. Hang on a second, nurse. What we should probably use is marijuana. That'll sufficiently sedate the patient for surgery. For surgery? <laughs> marijuana? But why? <laughs> but doctor, we don't have marijuana in this hospital. Shit. <gasps> oh, shit! He's spraying! Dogs, please. Doctor, the patient is de-statting. Dude, he's de-statting. He's de-statting. <laughs> that was genius. Thank you. Thank Great you. job. You guys did it. No, it's you. Sexy. What'd huh? you say? Nothing. What? <laughs> Good work, doctors, all around. Great. One of you uh, okay. clean this up, please. Put the chest in me. Yeah. Moist. That's okay. I'm not sweaty anymore. You please. <laughs> Sir, do you, uh, do you happen to know how to get to the White Castle and Cherry Hill from here? You take the 33 left and take the turnpike south, and there you are. I'm telling you. He's a hero. Wow. An angel literally gifted to them. <laughs> hey, dude, check it out. 16 Candles. Isn't that your favorite movie? Wow, man. That's <laughs> awesome. awesome. Yo, look who decided to go see it. Oh. Hey, we should ask her if she wants to come to White Castle. No. 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 Why not? Just pretend that you're like a nerdy Asian version of Tom Hanks and she's a hot Latina Meg Ryan. <laughs> what are you doing? What excuse you doing? me, Maria. What are, what are you doing? Maria, excuse me for a second. Come here. Oh, oh, Why does he keep sabotaging himself? I don't know. He almost killed the car. Let's just get back on the highway, okay? Fine with me. Oh. Nice. Where the hell's my spare tire? Oh yeah. Remember that time we got really stoned and started throwing shit off that bridge to see if it would float? Oh, uh. Excuse me, 
me! Hello! Over here! Excuse me! Oh. You always need your mail. Is that a troll? It looks like a troll! <laughs> oh, Jesus. Yo, he really looks like a troll. Thanks, what was his ears? Out. Yeah, the ears are the last thing I'm thinking of. Have you boys accepted Jesus as your Lord and Savior? Yes. Yeah, yeah he's great. <laughs> Whoa! Is he human? <laughs> no, he's not human! How do we get away from this I guy? I hear everything you see. That's so awkward. Sorry, Mr. Troll. Oh my god. It's gonna take me a while to fix up the car there, so you boys like me to go on inside, get yourself something to drink, wash up, fuck my wife, watch TV. What? Whoa! What? Wait, what was that? A second one? Oh, hi, boys. I'm Freak Show's wife, Leanne. Huh? <laughs> That's so. <laughs> I wasn't expecting this kind of interior. No, I wasn't. Well, the Jesus thing, yeah, but... We entered the twilight zone. Dude, Vienna's fucking hot. She's not ugly. Here you go, boys. Thank you. Thanks Thank a lot. You. Cool. We got lemonade. Do you want to play with them? Play with them. Oh, oh! He's gone! Well, I'm going to fix the tire! Oh! Oh no. You said outside that we could have sex with her. <laughs> oh! You sure? You said it. How about a foursome? Huh? Who wants first reach your ass? <laughs> 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 okay, let's agree to never talk about what just happened. Never. Agreed. The freak show reach around? A hitchhiker? What the hell? Oh. Should we pick him up? And get chopped to bits? Are you crazy? Well, you know what? We're lost. He may know how to get back on the highway. Yeah, it's fair enough, I guess. That's a risk. Hey, man. Hey, guys. Thanks for picking me up. <gasps> oh, oh. Excuse me. Are you Neil Patrick Harris? Yep. Did <laughs> <laughs> you ever get it on with Wando off the set? Dude, I humped every piece of ass ever on that show. Even the chick who played the hot nurse? I didn't go all the way with her. <laughs> whoa, whoa, why does it sound so ominous? Dude, what is that? Is that a pterodactyl? I do not know what. I don't know. Gamma and guard? Gamma and guard, yeah. Extreme guy! <laughs> the Cheetos! Man, that was so fucking extreme! <laughs> Whoa! What are you doing to him? Hey, asshole! Why don't you leave that guy alone and go jerk off to some snowboarding videos or something? <laughs> Why snowboarding? Yeah, wait, wait, what? That was oddly specific. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, they got him. They got him. One more time! Thank you, come again. Oh, no, he did just hit him with that. Oh, Damn, my dude. God! You okay? Yeah, dude, I just hate those assholes. You know what? Fuck it, I'm hungry. Let's just get out of here. Oh, of course. Yeah. Why did you leave the well, keys in the car? Why? Because it would get stolen. I figured that Neil Patrick Harris was a trustworthy guy. Come on, how was that? <laughs> this whole freaking night, this whole night is your fault. Where are you going? I'm going inside to call the police. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Ah. Uh... <laughs> yeah, it's not oh, worth going no. back in there, man. <laughs> You heard of jaywalking? Yes, I have. I'm really sorry. What happened again? That's great. I'm writing you up a ticket. A ticket? Are you serious? Who the fuck are you, shitwad? <laughs> Two thirty in the morning, and there's like there's not a car around here. It's like he was causing trouble. Kamar, shut up. That's not the kind of tone you want to use in a cop that could bust your ass. Bust my ass? Yeah, Kumar. Well, how do you say it like that? They're having a good old American names like Dave or Jim. You know, Harold. Harold. Are you kidding? No, that's great. Let me take. <laughs> <laughs> Better just arrest him. Does yeah. that work out for you okay, Harold? Perfect. Oh, great. Go, Harold. Your name, Harold. Thanks to your buddy. We're going yeah! down. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, no. Thank you so much for being understanding about Bradley. I promise you he won't ever do it again. <laughs> oh, no, what the? So, what are you in here for? For being black. <laughs> A fat, black. 
can't dance, and I have two gay fathers. There's no sense getting all riled up every time a bunch of idiots give you a hard time. Kind of relatable, the actually. tends to unfold as it should. Interesting. Plus, I have a really large penis. That keeps me happy. <laughs> <laughs> the hell are you doing? I just called and made up some story about a shooting in Millbrook Park. Jesus Christ, what'd you do that for? I'm fucking starving. I figured I'd bust you out. We'd go get some burgers. Not All bad. right, nice. Not bad. You sure you don't want to get out of here? And become a fugitive? Are you nuts? The guy has all my information. So what? We'll just take what he wrote down about you and leave. Unless you want to stay here all night and not be able to turn in your work tomorrow. Oh. oh. Sweet! I was hoping it'd be one of these big ring of keys. Come on, hurry the fuck up. All right, yeah. That's a lot of keys. Holy shit. Hey, what's the smell? What smell? What do you... Come on. Oh, the weed. His sixth sense. The baby. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> He's marrying it! <laughs> <laughs> no! No! Bitch! No! Fucking make coffee, you fucking whore! <laughs> no, baby, come on. What the? Hey, come on! Hey, what the hell is that? That's gotta be one of my favorite sequences in a movie. Come on! The cops! Are you thought you'd get away with it, huh? I was oh. in bed. I didn't fire any gun. I swear. Oh no! Hey! Jax is trying to escape! What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> oh no! If I were you, I'd leave as soon as possible. Okay, whose hand is that? Whose hand Thanks, is man. that? <laughs> <laughs> it's actually really funny. So good. So good. We're gonna die. Just stay really still. Don't move, okay? Oh! Whoa! Oh! 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 oh. oh. He wants the meat stick. Oh. Oh, he's nice. Oh, he's happy. Thank you for the beef jerky. Hey, Rold, I have an idea. Oh. You gotta be kidding me, man. Place it with the uh -oh. cheetah? <laughs> Interesting. This is either a really smart move or by far the stupidest thing that we have ever tried. Well, we're about to find out. They're gonna ride the cheetah? Ride the cheetah? This is awesome! We're gonna be a white castle in those <laughs> Wait, what's going what? on? Land of Burgers? Not the fact. Cook. I only wish to. <laughs> the burgers are happy. Oh, wow! God! You've been out cold for the past half hour. I figured maybe if I did some gay shit, you'd wake up. If I did some gay shit. What? What kind of reasoning? I want that. What, a hot dog heaven super chili cheese dog? I want that feeling. The feeling that comes over a man when he gets exactly what he desires. Hell yeah! I need that feeling. Are you saying what I think you're saying? We gotta go to White Castle. Yes! Yes! Oh, thank God. Hey, I got a plan. Oh. Okay. Oh. What are you doing? Oh, shit. Yeah! Oh. All okay. right. Okay. This is your plan. It's working, isn't it? Um. All right. Yeah, All I'm right. down. Interesting plan. Let's go. Anything for White Castle? Uh oh. <laughs> bingo. Yeah. No, dude. no, no, not bingo. You've been hit with the bingo, dude. Are you kidding me? What the hell are you doing? I'm not going back to jail, man. Oh. I've come too far now. Buckle up. Oh, hell okay. is losing it, okay. Oh. Oh. Don't shake the car! Oh, hurry up! Ow! They kill the car? Might as well. Hey, Roldy, check it out. Oh! It's there! It's beautiful. Shit, shit! We're trapped, man! Oh, not necessarily. No way. No. 
Yes! Good job, Roland. Keep running. Thank you. Hey, Roland. What? Something I forgot to tell you. What? I've never hang glided before. Ah! Ah! Not low. <laughs> Dick crop circles? Yeah, the aliens know what's up. I want 30 sliders, five french fries, and four large cherry cokes. I want the same, except make mine diet cokes. Uh, well, that comes to 46.75. Wait, for 60 oh, burgers? No. Money. Hey. You're on money? Dude, oh, are you kidding me? Yeah, no. the clock take I gave money? mine to that yeah. asshole Princeton. No, dude, this isn't happening. No, 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 no! Hey guys, oh! Dude, where's my car? Where's his car, dude? <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. I told you last night I was tripping balls. I don't know what came over me. Your car's in the parking lot. Here are your keys. Oh. Oh, nice. It was a dick move on my part. That's why I'm paying for your meal. All right, good enough. Thanks, I guess. Okay. Bucks for the burgers and 200 for the car. I made some love stains in the back seat. Anyway, nice meeting you guys. I'll catch you later. <laughs> <laughs> Wherever God takes me. <laughs> what? It's like the best exit quote, wherever God will take me. Oh, I'm just feeling hungry looking at this, man. Look at all those burgers. Mm. Dude. Boom. Oh, they are kind of small, the burgers, huh? Yeah, you could, you could, you could down 30 oh, of these, no problem. I could down, like, more than 30. Easy. Oh, yeah, look at that. Easy. Yeah, that's how you know it's good, man. The champion's meal. What the fuck is going on here? I thought you and JD were busy all night with clients. Isn't that why I had to do your work? Hey, Henry, what the hell's going Back on off, here? Back off, cockboy. Hey, yo! You're just stalling because you're not quick enough to think of a comeback. You think I'm not quick enough? Guy oh. thinks I'm not quick enough. Well, I got news for you. I am quick enough. Cockboy! <laughs> <laughs> Ever tries to pull this shit again, I'll go to Berenson myself, and I'll tell the whole office how you both caught gonorrhea from that prostitute in Atlantic City. If you'll excuse me, boys. I gotta get going. Kumar? See you boys at the office on Monday. <laughs> <laughs> Always give them the flinch check. What's the rush, dude? I don't have my interview for a couple of hours. I got some unfinished business to take care of. I thought those guys were gonna do the work. No, no, no. Unfinished business. Maria! Nice. 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 We're nice. Going back. When I see Maria, I'm gonna know exactly what to say. <laughs> Looks like you guys have had some night. <laughs> Shit, you know what? I yeah, I left my lighter in your car. Do you have me a favor and run down and get it for me, please? I, I, I gotta urinate. Nice. Nice! 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 nice. Alright, just say something, please. Come on. Oh. Anything. Oh. Remember the number! Good start, good start, buddy! Let me tell you what the best part of my day is. I come home from work and I walk through this lobby and on days that I'm lucky enough, I spend 10 seconds in this elevator with you. Okay, okay. I night in my life tonight. And I guess I learned that if you want something or someone, you have to go for it. Yeah, true, true, whoa, true. Okay, and if oh, whoa. Can make whoa, please! No! Ah! Shut up! Harold, shut up! Oh, fuck it. Yeah! Say less! Dizzy. We don't ever see. We don't talk, and so that was inappropriate. Oh, oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah! It's the power of White Castle. The power of White Castle, baby. We out here. Now you just have to work on your timing. Oh, where are you going? Amsterdam. I'll be back in 10 days. But I'll see you when I get back. Yeah, let's do that. Whoa, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bye, Harold. Uh, bye, bye. I'll see you later. <laughs> oh, God, Harold. <laughs> should touch your penis? <laughs> I'll see you when she comes back. Hey, Roldy. You do realize what's legal in Amsterdam, don't you? <sighs> oh, yeah. Say no more, baby. Say no more! All right, we just watched Harold Kumar go to White Castle, and it's just... Bro, I gotta say, man, I think stoner comedies are actually really, really good. Really good. We had, like, Friday, Pineapple oh, dude. Express. Friday is still one of my favorite comedies we've done. Friday's before. peak. Peacock. Uh, I, I love Debo, man. <laughs> Debo is Debo was a blessing, all right? 
But we had Friday, Pineapple Express, and now we have Harold and Kumar. Man, these are some like of the funniest films. I'm not gonna lie. Like, there's a lot of good jokes in these. I feel like with Harold and Kumar, I can kind of relate in terms of like, it's not about the burgers. It's about no. the goal, right? Yeah. You just set out for something and just, you know what? I really want this. I'll do whatever it takes just to get this. Even if it's as stupid as a goddamn burger from a specific chain of fast food, who gives a shit, all right? Yeah. You go out there and you give it your all to get that burger. You achieve your dreams. You achieve your dreams. You always go for your, I don't know what your burger is in life. But you go for your burger. Never give up on your burger. Never give up on your burger, and your burger will never give up on you. All right? But I, I'm kind of like, I'm interested in White Castle now. I've never, you know what the thing is? I've heard of White Castle before, but I've never tasted it. I know we don't have anything like it in Canada. I feel like it's a, I think, no, I think it might be like a, a, a States thing or a United American? States thing. Yeah, an American thing. But it's just like, guys, for the for the Americans out there, is, is White Castle good? Harold and Kumar makes it look like, yeah, the second coming of Jesus. I'm, I'm it, not even gonna lie. Like, I gotta be real. When they showed that, like, that that like little advertisement on the TV, man, it was kind of erotic. I was like, okay, right. I was kind of feeling something. I'm, I'm feeling White Castle I was feeling too. Something in my plums. Something in my plums. Something in my plums. No, I man. I, I was just like, I'm kind of interested in White Castle. Is it good? Like, I just even know. Is it? Yeah, guys. I, it, it, is White Castle worth it? But one day I might come to America. And I might try a White Castle burger, so I need to know if it's worth the hype, if it's worth my efforts. We need to understand. We need to know. The burgers look tiny. They look tiny. Yo, like, where they said we're going to slam down 30 of these bad boys. I'm like, yo, well, that's impressive. Well, they did say sliders, right? True, that was, that was true, a, true, true. You know, sliders slider. are pretty small. Sliders are kind of small, man. But yeah. man, you downing 30 sliders, man, that's a meal, dude. That's a nice meal. Yeah. Oh, that's, a, that's, a, that's great. I think I could have downed like 80 of those bad boys, man. I'm going to be real with you. I already looked I, would, I already know I look like it, so I ain't going to say Oh, 100%, shit. man. You're fat as hell. <laughs> what can I say? <laughs> but it's just like, bro. I just I want I want to down some burgers now. This movie is just like burger propaganda. <laughs> burger propaganda. All right. It makes you want to eat a nice, tasty, juicy, delectable burger. Mm. All right. Mm -mm. I wasn't craving it. I couldn't care less about it. Now I need it. I don't know what it is. Oh, dude, Ryan Reynolds is beautiful. Why did you have to say that out of nowhere? Just thought I knew everybody needed to know that. The oh. greatest thing that's ever come out of Canada, next to me. <laughs> <laughs> I, I didn't expect him to be a random surgeon. I didn't expect to see Ryan Reynolds, and I didn't expect to see Neil Patrick Harris. Oh, Neil, Neil Patrick Harris is always a uh, a wonderful surprise. You know, yeah, he I, can surprise me at any moment in my life, and I'll be like, that's kind of rad. I don't know. I just I, I enjoyed the movie a lot. Like I don't know what it was. Just something about I, the jokes are just way too good. A lot of the jokes are so damn good. Jokes are good. Oh my god, I think my favorite scene in this entire movie... You know what? The best segment of this entire film is in, when they're in the prison. Oh, god. Just so many good jokes going left yeah. and right. When he had, when he had like that vision of his future with the bag of Oh weed, my god, I that was like that so the, much. That was the funniest thing I've ever seen in so long, man. And then, he, and then the relationship gets abusive in the end. Like, <laughs> what the? He's like, pick a pair, copy a bitch. And Bro, I was like, damn, dude, that, that, that's a little too real. Dude, take it back. You know, respect your bag of weed, man. Respect her, okay? Yep. She's a beautiful lady, please. And I got the guy, what are you arrested for? Being black? <laughs> And I love it when they come in, they run away talking, he's escaping! He's escaping! He's literally just reading his book. He's got a gun! <laughs> <laughs> that shit was wild, man. Even, like, the ending there, the after credits, when they show, like, the pictures of how they looked, man. Like, I had a feeling they were going in that direction. Oh, I knew it was... But I didn't know they were going to I didn't, go like I didn't that. think it was going to be that specific. Like, absolutely... <laughs> dude, again... This film is absolutely incredible. Also, like, even Harold is a really good character, you know? I feel like a lot of people can relate to Harold. He's always, like, um... A pushover. Not, not only is he a pushover, but, but man... He really he... belittles himself and really just settles. He never actually takes initiative or stands he up just, for himself. He doesn't do what he wants. Yeah, You know what much. I mean? He's always just letting everybody decide what he needs to do. or And he's always, like, he just won't put himself out there. He's just like, oh, I guess this is just my life. This is just how it is. Yeah. You know? And sometimes you just need Neil Patrick Harris to come and steal your car and everything changes. For the better. For the better. For the better. Yeah, but I feel like there's a lot of people like that where they kind of just like, they don't just think they deserve better. or They, they... think so little of themselves and then they deserve nothing. You know, yeah. they deserve the bare minimum in life when they deserve a lot more, when they could obtain a lot more, you know? Yeah, it's sad. Sometimes you just got to like... Take initiative in your own life, you know? Try to make some moves. and, and Put your and, foot down! And and just make an effort, you know? Down! Like, I think we've had the conversation several times, times and times again. Like, you know, 
even if you fail, just at least try. Not even that, but don't be afraid to say no. Don't be afraid to put your I th- foot down. You know what? I think that's a big thing. I feel like a lot of people struggle to just flat a out lot say, of people... I don't want to do this or no. Yeah, you know the thing is, it's not a bad word. To say no to something is not bad. If no. someone's if someone's literally trying to push their work off on you, and they're oh, just being a lazy God. sack of shit, they're just being a loser. Dude, I hate that. Yo, that like, that shit really pisses me yeah, off. Yeah, if, if, if your co-worker's being a loser and he's trying to push his work on you, say no. Tell them to eat shit and die. All right? For real. Just straight up, man. That ain't your work. You're not getting paid to do this. Bro, yep. not your problem, all right? Screw him. All right? Yep. You, in life, sometimes you just got to say no and put your foot down. I think there's lots of people that I know that need to learn this. Oh, God, right? yeah. Your life will become infinitely better if you're not a doormat at every every chance there no, is. Because, like, imagine that. Because the moment you say yes, oh, they will always target you and give you more random shit to do. Well, yeah, because you know what the worst part is? You say yes once, they will abuse that yes. They know you're a kind person and they will abuse your kindness. Yep. Sometimes kindness is actually like... It's a double-edged sword. Yep. The other thing is, you could be kind, but you need to understand when you should be kind. Not you, everyone deserves your kindness. Not everyone deserves kindness or respect. Nope. You know? You need to know who deserves it and who doesn't. You know, you gotta selectively yep. be kind because you shouldn't give it just to anyone. You know? At the end of the day, first and foremost, you should respect yourself. Yeah. You know, like when he stood up to his, uh, those, uh, his other, the other employees there at the White Castle and stuff. And not even just that, like, just making that definitive decision. I'm going to White Castle. Screw work. Screw life. Screw everything. Sometimes you just got to do something that makes you happy. Yep. That's it. It could be, again, it could be something as stupid as I want to eat a White Castle burger. Yeah. Just go do it. Why not? If you have that feeling and you just want to do it, go do it. That thing's going to make you happy. Boom. Just go hit up White Castle, yes. man. Eat some sliders, dude. Pound, Sometimes pound 30 back, man. You, you got to go out of your way to make yourself happy. That's it. I think that's the most important thing. A lot of people are lacking effort in making themselves happy. And sometimes it's just the small things. It's just the little things that you feel like doing. You know? It's as simple as that. Uh, we've been going on for far too long, guys. We want to save a lot more of this kind of stuff in the podcast. Yeah, before we get too deep on it. Yeah, we don't want to get too deep. I feel like there's a lot more I would like to talk about. I'm going to save it for yeah, that. Specifically, like, about Kumar as well and stuff. So There's a lot more to talk about. We talked a bit about Harold, but there is a lot more about Kumar that I would like to judge. But anyways, we're done. We're done. We're, we're, we're out of here, guys. Adios, guys. We'll see you next time. Have a great one. Love you guys. Bits and pieces. Big hearts all around. Bye.